A common size statement is a vertical analysis. Basically what it does is it takes a set of financial statements, okay, in this case pulling from our database of, of industry information, and instead of showing the average dollar amounts for the accounts, it shows the financial statements in proportional or relational terms to each other. So within your firm, if you're researching an industry and have access to a common size statement for the industry, this is where I would start. If you have access to multiple periods of data, you want to zero in first on the most recent year or period of data that you have. What is going on right now at this immediate moment in time? On the income statement, every account on a common size financial statement is shown as a percentage of sales. Everything on the income statement is a percentage of sales or shown in relation to sales. So we're going to start here for, for full service restaurants, and we're going to look at where money is coming in the door. We're going to look at a breakdown between food sales or revenues and beverage sales. Okay. So roughly 70% of revenue for one to ten million dollar restaurants is coming from their food sales. The other thirty percent from beverage sales. Okay. From there, we want to look at a breakdown of revenues. So where where are they spending money? Okay. So let's look at, for example, comparison between direct labor costs and GNA payroll, or kind of administrative indirect labor costs. How much are they spending on advertising, etc.? So we're looking at where money is coming in the door and out of the door. A breakdown of revenues and expenses, and then we're